So guys, if you are looking for a virtual dollar card that you can use for anything that has to do with online payments, both you know shopping on Amazon, AliExpress, and a whole lot of other stuff that you do with dollar cards online, all right, then I have a perfect recommendation for you. I mean, this is an app that offers the best customer service. Their exchange rate is way cheaper than cheaper cash and other, you know, expensive dollar card um, apps and websites, all right. So this app is everything you need to get, uh, you know, started with shopping online and doing your other dollar related transactions online without having to own a Nigerian dollar account, all right. So let's jump right into it. Let me show you how to use this app and also what app I am also talking about, all right. So let's mm -hmm. get started. Bye. Alright guys, so the name of the app we are going to be using to create the dollar card, the virtual dollar card is called Social Cash, alright? So you can download it on your Play Store, alright? So this is it, you go to your Play Store, you search for Social Cash, alright? So this is it, you click on install, alright? So We are going to install this app on our phone and create an account with it. All right, so um, we'll continue the video after I must have downloaded the app. Oh, okay, it's downloaded fast, so let's just continue with the video. All right, so all right, so this is it. You click on open. All right, you sign up with the app. All right with your email and you verify your account very necessary all right so click on create account put in our details you put your country all right so in this situation we're going to be using all right so you put in your details all right your email address, your username, your date of birth, and other stuff, right? It's important that you use the correct details because you'll be asked to verify this app Remember, is a financial app, all right? So, Okay, so this is it. All right. Um, you click on sign up. So I'm going to log into my account right now. So you see, you have to create your PIN and also you need to complete your KYC, alright? So Alright, so I have created my PIN. And I need to verify my email, all right? So I go to my email and um, copy my code, all right? So you can see. Click on continue. 
and you'll be verified. All right, so the next thing you need to come to your profile, you click here to verify your details. All right, click on verification. You can either verify with your address and your BVN or verify with your um, BVN and your selfie. All right, so we're going to be using the first one. All right, so put your house address and everything and verify it. I'm not going to be doing it here. All right, so. But after I verify this account, I'm going to come back and show you how to create your card. All right, so that is it. You just click on. You can see I need to verify the account. So when I'm done verifying this account, I'm going to continue this video from there. All right, thank you. All right, so we are back. All right, so I verified this account. Okay, so if you come here, you'll see that the account is already verified you can see that's green stuff all right so to verify your accounts all you just have to do is you know you come here click on verification you put your address and you put your bvn and you do a selfie in less than 24 hours your account is going to be verified and once your account is verified you can now be able to create a card all right so that is it now let's get back to the social cash app right so this is my app you can see i've already funded the money i'll use and create my card all right so that is it now how to fund your money you just come here you click on add cash all right so when you click on add cash you can click on instant transfer then um you put your amount let's say you want to um you can see this is the minimum amount you can fund. So let's say you want to fund 1,000, you put 1,000 and you click on next. Then they will tell you that um, they are going to generate your account for you, all right? So we'll provide their account details for you to make your deposits. Remember to use the exact details. So you click on find my match. When you click on it, you see why we find your match. Please note, always remember to uh, put your narration id when funding your account to complete the transaction what does this narration id means it means that anytime you are funding your account anytime you are funding your uh, social cash account always make bank transfer and anytime you are making that bank transfer put this code here as your narration id don't forget put this code here as your narration id is very very important all right so that is it so once you have once you have gone to your bank app to make your transfer you come back here and click on i have made my deposit all right there are other ways you can deposit all right but they are still coming all right so that is it um so you can see this is the, the swap option, pay bills, buy a time, and so on and so forth, all right? But remember, what we want to do now is create our card, all right? So, we'll come here, we'll click on card, all right? So, if you click on card, you're going to see Gladys Naira card. With this Naira card, you can use it and run Facebook as this card works. Even, it works on Facebook, you're with a Facebook Naira account. Anytime pay you is down, this social cash Naira card always works, all right? So that is it. So let's click on card again and go to dollar card, all right? So click on dollar card. When you click on dollar card, you can see um, card creation fee is um, $5. Uh, initial deposit is $5. Um, minimum card balance, 0.0. .0 um a transaction fee capped at one at five all right so uh, um 3d secure paste your mark all right so if you come here too you can see the fees are the same the fees are the same you can see it's the fees are the same card creation fee initial deposit maximum card balance ten thousand all right let me see the maximum card balance here Okay, this one does not have a maximum, but it has minimum card balance, all right? Maximum card balance, $10,000. Um, transaction fee capped at uh, $1 at um, $5, all right? So, 3D secure. Yeah, so let's um, go with um, Master Card, all right? So, let's see. The Visa Card offers extensive acceptance, allowing you to make international payments across platforms. Why? With Mastercard, you can use the Black Card on crypto platforms, Wise, Stripe, PayPal, Netlast, um, AliExpress, Alidada, Facebook, 
digital ocean google name chip and many more all right so let's just click on create new card all right so proceed please note that the cannot be spent or withdrawn the five dollar is reserved for the monthly card maintenance fee in subsequent months a card is automatically deleted if active if inactive for three months kindly take note to avoid decline transactions all right so that is it we'll just click on proceed all right so let's proceed so you put your pin create a new pin all right so i'm just going to create a new pin all right so what if i roll okay so uh click on continue all right so i'm just going to click on proceed to payment all right wallet balance up okay so insufficient funds wow okay so you, you guys have seen how i did that i guess the uh eight thousand two hundred is not up to five dollars that is the reason why it did not go through all right all right guys so the reason why the first calculation process did not go through is because i did not transfer my money i didn't swap my my naira to dollar first so I'm going to show you how you can do that right now. All right. So the first thing you need to do is to click on this swap here. All right. You can see it. Click on swap. Then you input how much you want to, um, you know, you just put, let's say, 7,800, which is going to give us almost um, um, 5.1 cent dollars. All right. So let's click on continue. All right. So you just click on continue. Uh, yeah. You click on proceed. Okay. Oh, you can see how much you get, which is not enough to create cards. So you have to make sure that you put enough money that will be enough to create a card. So let me say, okay, zero point five is that is actually their fee. So you have to let's say put eight five, so that you, it will be enough, all right. So when they take their five cents, it, you will still have your um five dollar complete, all right. So you just click on continue. Click on proceed, all right. Then click on swap. You put your pin, all right. So, all right. So you can see your dollar account, your dollar wallet has been created. So you go back to your home screen, all right. So the next thing we need to do now is to click on card, all right. So click on dollar card. I've already showed this process before, but let me just show it again, all right. So, um. You can see all right so you just click on create um new card all right so um click on proceed put your pin all right put your pin uh, put your pin all right then you click on continue all right so you can see it. um insufficient funds again okay let's try creating a dollar card all right a virtual card rather a virtual card created successfully okay let me see um click on cards and see one of the cards has already been okay your dollar card has been created successfully. You can see it has created. So, all right, guys. So after you have created your dollar card, the first thing you need to do is to refresh your app, or better still, just close the app and log in again. All right, and you know, open it up again so that you can be able to view your cards. All right. So what you have to do is to click on this place card. All right. When you click on it, you are going to see an option to view your card or you can see you see view cards click on view cards and you are going to see um your card details just by clicking on it okay so that is it all right so you can see you can cash out you can add cash you can freeze your account depending on what you want all right so this is your card details now you might be wondering why the visa card did not go through even though i had money in the account all right so to create a dollar visa card 
you need to mastercard rather you need to have five dollar uh, card creation fee and also have extra five dollar that will be in the account when you create it so to create a dollar card you need to have ten dollars in your um, dollar wallet all right before you can be able to create a mastercard rather to create a mastercard you need to have ten dollar in your dollar wallet all right for the card creation process for mastercard to be successful but to create a visa card you can um you know do that with five dollar all right so i hope that is clear if you got value from this video do let me know in the comment section i'm going to drop a link for you to um, register on this um, website on this app and create your account all right so if you have any question do well to drop it in the comment section and i will attend to it all right so thank you very much for watching see you on my next video don't forget to subscribe to this wonderful channel because i bring you lots of educative and informative videos all right thank you for watching bye